All right, what's up, guys? Now that we have Spotify installed, let's um make on um developer.spotify.com. And if you already have a Spotify account, you're pretty much good to go. Just go to My Apps, and then um, I just gotta log in here. Let's create an app. Um, say no if you don't want to monetize it. Let's name it Test App X. This app will allow users to see album artwork for specific sound. And then let's agree to all of these and create the app. All right. So now we need to edit one setting in here. Go to edits, redirect URIs, and just type in google.com with a forward slash at the end. Make sure you don't forget that forward slash. Click add, and then click save. All right, so now we have our test app in here. Um, next thing we need to do is start writing our Python code. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to open up Adam here. And I'll just start it from scratch for you. Um, so go to File, Save As, and name it SpotifyXX.py. And make sure you save it on your desktop. All right, so. I'll start writing some code. We're going to need to import a few different libraries, and I'm just going to go through this pretty quickly. So, OS, Sys, JSON, Spotify, Web Browser, and import Spotify.util as util, and then we're going to import json.decoder, actually this is going to be from json.decoder, import json decode error, um, now we're going to get the username, This is going to be an argv, so basically um, when we run this, we're going to type in python3. You guys don't need to do this now, but it's going to be pythonxx.py, and then we're going to have the username. And so we're just going to say in python um, username equals sys.argv1. And your username from your Spotify account, I need to make a note about this. In order to get it, you need to go to your Spotify application, tap your name, tap this these three little dots, click share and copy profile link. I'm just going to paste it in here. So the thing about user IDs is only certain people have user names. Anyone who created their Spotify account with Facebook doesn't have a username. It's just this number here. So we're just going to save this as a comment. And now that we have our user ID, we can move on to the next step. And I'm going to make another video. So I'll see you guys in a second.